Hi everybody, Nem here. I have uh, recently had a request from a fellow forum member to see what the uh, LCD on the new Tyrannus Plus looks like, so here we go. Welcome to OpenTX. As you can see with this flash screen and this little graphics down here, the uh, graphics still tend to be a little bit fuzzy. That's because uh, the graphics have not been optimized for the new LCD yet. They're still from the original firmware. If you look over here, though, you can see text and block diagrams are, are very crisp and very clear with no, no visible uh, bleeding whatsoever. As I move into text-only menus, you can see also that uh, text and uh, symbols are clean and crisp and clear with no bleeding. I have my contrast set almost all the way up at 40 and it's still crisp and clear. The uh, blacks aren't quite as black as I would like. They're not as black as the uh, as my 9XR but they're ve still very good and I'm hopeful that uh, when they optimize the firmware for the new LCD to fix those graphics at the same time, they will also um, fix, you know, make the blacks a little bit blacker. If I move down to this uh, option on the menu, I can change the color. Right now, it is set so that both the white and the blue backlights are on. This produces this pleasant uh, sky blue color. If I uh, move all the way over this, whoops. If I move. Uh, all the way over this way. I can turn on the uh, usual deep dark blue that uh, m most members, most users of the Tyrannus are already familiar with. And if I move it all the way this way, I can bring it to uh, plain white. This looks a little bit gray. It's not quite as bright as the uh, page white displays or the uh, digital paper displays that we might be familiar with but it again it is still crisp and clear and very good contrast I personally prefer it with both uh, backlights on at the same time in my opinion that produces a bit more brightness and a little bit more contrast and there we have it that's pretty much my detail of the uh, new display while I'm here with the camera, I would like to uh, take a moment to give you a quick peek inside the Tyrannus. Uh, people, I'm sure, are curious to see what's new. And, well, truth be told, it's pretty much everything that's new. Uh, they have a new main board to support the uh, new LCD. New LCD part number is uh, LCM2126A-00. I've googled that, I can't find any hits, so I'm guessing that it's uh, probably a custom LCD made for FreeSky just for this radio. That means there probably won't be any ready available alternatives. Uh, as you can see, the main board is connected to the RF board by these ribbon cables. They're quick connects at each end, which I like. I like this design in that it, uh, the ribbon cables make it look a lot less uh, cluttered. However, this design means that if you wanted to upgrade a regular Tyrannus to uh, the Tyrannus Plus, uh, it wouldn't be effective. I mean, you'd be looking at LCD, backlight, <coughs> main board, and RF board. Cost of parts would make that prohibitive. You'd be better off uh, just getting a whole radio, which I'm sure is part of the marketing involved. One thing I did want to point out to you, uh, we had some concern about the fact that we have no uh, working uh, SWR. Uh, it appears that the RF module on this is actually a module, a separate part. This board here connected with this row of pins and this row of pins. So I suspect that probably uh, if they do resolve that issue, those of us who uh, have the, the early release uh, Tyrannus can probably result, fix that, get the SWR working just by replacing this module. Otherwise everything is pretty much the same. The gimbals remain the same and the switches remain the same. Also the same is the little bitty uh, ho-hum yeah, speaker, although it does appear to be a bit 
more tightly sealed around up here. Uh, that probably accounts for the slightly better volume and clarity. Like most other Tyrannus users, I'm probably going to wind up building a sound box in here and uh, putting in a bigger speaker. That pretty much concludes my tutorial of the uh, new 9XR, uh, the new X9D Tur Plus, Tyrannus Plus. Uh, I'm going to run through those uh, menus for you again real quick so you can uh, see them again. Welcome to OpenTX.